Hey, what's up guys and welcome back to another Fortnite video. This time we have another prop parkour map, which actually seems like it's going to be quite fun. Looks like there's some good props around. But before we get into it, I just want to say a huge thank you for getting me to 200 subscribers. It's absolutely awesome. And let's just keep pushing up to 500 and just keep the channel growing. So, let's get started. We need that, we need that, and then we need to pick a prop. And you can become the Mega Mall sign? Really? Okay, that's quite cool. Right, um, can I actually fit through there? No, I can't. Okay, don't become the Mega Prop. That one doesn't work. But if you do enjoy this video, don't forget to drop that like, subscribe to my channel, and hit that notification bell. That way you won't miss out on any future awesome content. And I need to find a decent prop. So what do we have? We have this little thing. I don't know what it actually is. It looks like a dog's bowl, but it's not. Don't know what it is. We've got some flowers. We've got a pig sign. We've got this giant guy. Might have to give him a try. He looks awesome. Then we've got a miniature one. Golf clubs and a ticket machine. So, let's go with the big guy, if he can fit through the gap. I know the mega one couldn't, but, right, he can. Oh, that's right, there's a nice little platform. What's this writing say? Traps don't work on props, so you will have to manually respawn if you fall. Okay, that's good to know. Right, let's jump over. Right, there we go. Now, if you've seen my last prop parkour map, you'll know that it's very hard to see where you're going. So, if you see me randomly jumping, it's to look for that little puff of smoke. So I know where my feet are actually supposed to be. But we made it. Each level has a prop room in case you have to respawn and reapply a prop. Well, we could continue with this one. But if everyone has a prop room, then we could just keep changing props. So we're going to try them all out. So I'm thinking next up we try flowers. Let's do the flowers. Nice pretty little flowers. So whereabouts are we on this one? Right, pretty much centre. That's pretty good. I like that. Right. Onto there. Almost over jumped it. Onto there. Okay, that is just weird because it looks like I'm just hanging off the edge. But apparently I'm standing on it. So I guess my feet aren't completely centre then. That's just weird. We're just going to get off of that just in case it does mess up and we fall. But we've got another coin. Another checkpoint. Which means another prop. So what have we got coming up? We've just got loads of platforms again. Okay, well for this one, I'm going to say we go for... Let's go for this little thing. We've gone big, medium, small. So it works. Um, okay, that's horrible. You actually get lost underneath it. Where's the first... Where am I? I'm there. Okay, I do... oh, Wait. I thought props couldn't die. That's just really weird. They said that props couldn't die, but it died. I'm I'm guessing that small one probably isn't the best one to do. I know the jump size is still the same as if I just jumped right now. But I think it's because I couldn't see the edge properly. So I think we're going to have to go for a slightly bigger one. So let's go for Mr. Ticket Machine. It looks quite cool. But it's going to be... Right, okay, so it's just off to the left of it. That's where I need to be lining up. There we go. Made the first jump. Made the next one. Just don't fall off. Made the next one. I'm guessing I'm going for that one there. Made that. <laughs> oh, the concentration levels when you're using props. Just so you don't walk off the edge. It's so hard to know where the legs are. Right, and then... Wait. I can't get through the gap. I'm too big for it. Okay, well, we could turn the prop off and die. Right, so we can't go too small and we can't go too big. So, golf clubs. That's pretty much the one between that and the smallest thing. So, we'll go golf clubs. We need to see roughly where we are. Pretty much centre, almost. Bottom of the bag, I think. Yeah, bottom of the bag. That makes it a little bit easier. This one's a bit easier to see, apart from when that thing pops up. I still don't know how to turn that off. So if you know how to turn that off, let me know in the comments. Because I really have no idea. It just keeps showing up. Onto there. Onto that one. I really wish... There we go. Get out of my face. Come on. Onto there. Up onto there. 
Right, please tell me I can get through the gap for this time. No. Maybe I need to just jump from further back. Right, we're going to go with the golf clubs again. But, on the last one, we're going to jump from slightly further back. So, first one. On there. Second one. I'm going to become a master at this level, at this rate. If I just keep dying, I'll just nail every one of these jumps. Come on. Onto there. Onto there. Now we need to jump from... There we go. Just jump from slightly further back and you can make it through. So what have we got this time? Oh, that looks horrible. Okay, well for this one, we're going to go really small and take this little dude. Because he looks fun. Do you know what? Let's go behind because whatever angle you shoot him from is how you'll actually end up becoming the prop. So if I do it from behind, then at least we'll be facing the right way. There we go. He is so tiny. Where's the centre? I think it's exactly where I am. There's no puffs coming up though. I think it's roughly that standing foot, maybe. Yeah, I think it is. Right, round here. Don't fall off the edge. Oh, and I fell off the edge. Of course. It's really hard to do those sort of running and then looking round in the air while jumping thing. Because I'm using an Xbox controller because I can't be able to go sit at my desk. So, that's why it's quite awkward. So we're going to go up on there. We're going to go round again. And we're going to give this another go. And I overjumped it. Okay, well, that was just bad. Right, golf clubs it is. I felt comfortable using golf clubs before. We're going to use those. Just make sure we know where the centre is. Bottom of the bag again, roughly. We're going to use this. Onto there. Round here. Right, let's um actually try and make it this time. There we go. Onto there. Onto there. We're making it now. We're good. It's still really weird to see those leg bits hanging off because that's where I want my legs to be. It'd make life a lot easier. Do I have to do a big run up on this? No, surely it's just a short... <gasps> Almost over jumped that. I didn't like that. That was horrible. I'm so scared of walking off the edge. Ooh, I just I need to stop pushing forward all the time while I'm in, in the air. Because when I land, I just end up walking off the edge. Right. Come on. Yes. Oh, thank God for that. So what have we got here? Okay, we've got signs. And I noticed you can actually become quite a few of the props that you're trying to be. So since we've used every prop, I'm just going to become this and try and do it with this one. Oh, I think that could work, actually. Um, oh, they haven't actually put death zone here. I need to respawn. I don't want to have to keep using the uh, golf bag because otherwise it's just going to be boring. But I think that's what we're going to have to do. We'll try this little guy again. It didn't get a fair chance last time, I don't think. Because I think it was just me messing up. Now, the problem is, this little ledge here where it glitches out slightly, you can't actually jump on that, so it messes up your jump. It's a problem with the game that they still haven't fixed, which is really annoying. So you sort of have to time your jumping right either before it or just after it. Like that, but I went over again. I don't know, but what we're going to have to do is just go good old golf bag. I trust the golf bag. I know where the feet are on it. I trust it. There we go. On there. On there. The golf bag is definitely the easiest prop to use. Now it's just about making this jump up here. Oh, just about make it with the golf bag. That's fine though. This is the bit where it's going to get tricky because I can't see where my feet are because I thought it was right near the edge of the bag, but apparently it's not. But it's fine. Oh no, I don't like these corner ones. And I messed up. Let's go again. On to there. Come on. We're just going to fly through it this time. You watch. First time, every time. On every jump. Onto there. Up onto there. No hanging around. Onto there. That's good. Onto there. Oh, we are flying through it. 
Come on. Up onto there. Oh, no. There's a door. I don't like doors. But we made it through. We're good. Oh, no. It's one of these ones where it's just multiple jumps in a row. Um, I'm trying to think what might be best for this one. Do you know what? We're going to give the little guy another try. I really want to test out whether he's actually any good at anything. Because at the moment he just seems rubbish at everything. But he looks so cool. And I just couldn't make the first jump. Awesome. Have I actually made the first jump on any of these ones yet? We'll give him another go though. Oh, it's so hard to aim because you can't aim down sight with that gun. There we go. Right. Come on. Oh. Oh. That was my fault. I clicked too late. Oh, that almost worked though. I do hate the colliders on this game. They are so awkward. If you're just too far to the edge. Am I not going to fall short on that? Oh, look at that. Golf clubs for the win. Oh, that's quite cool. Do you know what we're going to do? Because we've used all of the props. I kind of want to use the Mega One or him. But, obviously, these are all props we haven't used before. So, we're going to become that. Um, okay. Well, that one doesn't have the water. This one does, and that just looks really weird. Am I actually going to be able to make this? Right. On to there. Then, we become that. And we didn't make it. Respawn. Alright, so, you seen them props. Didn't work. So, we're going to go for the big guy. He, has, he only did, like, the first level, I think. So, we're going to go with him. I don't know where his feet are. Right, just off of the back of his standing foot, I think. Yeah. So, onto there. Onto there. Oh, this guy is so hard to use. Oh, I don't like him. Almost. Alright, up onto here. And we made it. I can't actually fit in, though. Um, How do I get in? Oh, I can become that, can I? Can that fit in? Oh, I think it can. Um, no, go in. Right, that can't fit in either, so I'm going to have to come off of it. How far does this actually reach? Right, it's not got that great a range then. It's basically to there. But we can become that. Although that's huge as well. Is that going to make it through? No. Okay, I don't think any of these props can actually make it through. What about that one? Oh, that one can. Nice. Oh, okay. Congrats, you're a prop parkour pro. Nice. Thank you. So, yeah. That was actually a pretty cool map. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, don't forget to drop that like. Subscribe to my channel and hit that notification bell. That way you won't miss out on any future content. Thank you again for 200 subs. Keep pushing this channel up. Let's keep it growing. And I'll see you in the next one. Peace out. <laughs>